preserve the freedom we all cherish. So first ones, just come on up and we'll get you introduced here. And then stand up here. <laughs> Don't be shy. Come on up. Mark Van Alken, U.S. Army. Larry Kimmel, U.S. Army. Darwin Bolt, U.S. Army. Eugene James Lampy, U.S. Army. Bill Wensenberg, United States Marine Corps. Jim Bockhouse, U.S. Army. Merlin West, U.S. Army. Linda Gray, Women's Army Corps. My name is Marvel Gray, United States Navy. <laughs> Dave Dirksen, United States Navy Submarine Service, EM3SS. Lloyd Kicker, U.S. Army. Sally Bergman Dietrich, U.S. Navy. Carl Dietrich, Senior Chief Electrician, Retired Navy. Larry Buchholz, U.S. Navy. Roger Buchholz, U.S. Army. Rich Gatmire, U.S. Embassy. Kim Carroll, U.S. Navy. Clay Rathbone, United States Army. Dave George, U.S. Navy. Dean Peterson, U.S. Army. Jim Shores, U.S. Army. Scott Bell, U.S. National Guard. Brian Chris, Army National Guard. George, U.S. Navy. Alan Schwamm, U.S. Navy. Kurt Merman, U.S. Army. Roger McBride, U.S. Army. Paul Krieger, U.S. Navy. U.S. Army. Brother Dees, Iowa Army National Guard. That's right. Gerald Pitt, U.S. Army. Deeper Navy. Yaldi <laughs> Miller, U.S. Army. Dave Schwartz, U.S. Army. Mike Nuss, U.S. Army. Bill Brandner, U.S. Army, and I'd like to recognize the firing squad members that were there. They were all veterans, and uh, they can't leave their post to come up and introduce themselves, but they're all great guys, and we, uh, we're going to do our firing here in just a short time. Roger Andrews. U.S. Army, U.S. 55369235. Elmer Mathias, U.S. Army. Steve Hahn, U.S. Army. 
Bill Bettman, U.S. Air Force. Yeah. Mary Carol Rathbone, U.S. Army. Marcia Zidier Corbett, U.S. Army. Heard this story, I was going to say, and then I got up there and I forgot what I was going to talk about. Um, my brother Junior joined the CCC camp. Do you know what that was? No, I that was a conservation camp they had for people during the Depression. And he, all the kids in town went, so he wanted to go, so he lied about his age and said he was uh, 17 instead of 16. And so when the draft came along, we thought that you had to do everything. You know, he'd signed up with the, that he was that old. So he signed up for the draft a year before he had to. And he went to Ireland with the first contingent, and he never came home. He was killed in the Battle of the Boat. And I wanted to tell all the young people in the audience that you should never tell a lie. That's what happens. <laughs> How's that first? Dick Richard there was in Pearl Harbor, and he was reported to kill, but later on they found him out covered with oil. He was alive. He was reported, we had got a telegram that he was killed in action, and then they found him out at sea, but he was covered in oil, and they didn't know who they were for quite a few days. So we were ready to have memorial services up here, and my folks got a telegram that he was found alive. Misprint badly, or or some relative from way back when.